tissue. Was this one of the things you mentioned? Ryan. <laughs> no, that's Ryan. <laughs> it's me! You wanna give away Ryan? No! How dare! That's our Ryan. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to 4 Pixels! Coco, Kinetsu, and Kimi are here with our guest Ryan and we are continuing Danganronpa 2. Woohoo! That, that's a line to get back to? <laughs> and whispered sweet nothings to me. And whisper into my ear. <laughs> Hinata! <laughs> Today, 2.30pm. Come to the supermarket. But don't tell anyone else about it. Huh? I'll tell you the, de the details later. Everyone else can see us right now. It's bad. What does he mean, it's bad? Sono. Hey, what are you lowly creatures discussing amongst yourselves? Yeah. No, nothing. It's got nothing to do with you, so just relax and go away. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Did you think I was worried about you fiends? <laughs> you make me laugh. Laugh, I say. You've elevated arrogance into an art form. <laughs> What sort of supreme ruler feels concern for the ants who are destined to be crushed? My name is Gundam Tanaka. I am the forbidden ruler who makes even the god of darkness flee in terror. All I desire is silence and indifference. Silence and indifference. I never took him for the lonely type. <laughs> anyway, Hajime, that's what's happening, so I'll see you then. You so you know. Make sure you conserve your energy. Huh? Conserve my energy? <laughs> I'll see you later. What was that about? Instead of talking about games, I receive a strange request from Kazuichi. And that day's breakfast came to an end. Um, Kazuichi told me to go to the supermarket at 2.30pm. But what did he mean when he told me to conserve my energy? Well, I guess I shouldn't wander too far right now. Alrighty. So let's just proceed to wander all across the island. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, wait, actually... So let's see if we have the headset you said was another one. Yeah, there's the headset and there's the... We're out of clackers. Even though I thought we had gotten yeah. more of them. Desperation, whatever that is, I don't think we have that. Uh, I'm not entirely sure we have the headphones. What it, number are they? Maybe it'd be easier to go by the number. It doesn't say, sadly. Oh, oh there it is. Desperation, there it is. Oh. oh, and we have two of those. The Collection of Famous Songs by Tatsuro Furata. A Furuta. Folk... Fur oh, Furuta. A folk singer... Furuta? Um, Furuta! <laughs> Are in you guys here. talking about flutes? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, no, no.
Huh, where'd she go? Hmm, did I miss her? Somewhere? That's weird. She's just not available at all? I guess so. Unless... Huh. Where's my girl? She's hiding from us. No! <laughs> she wouldn't be in the building, would she? Maybe. Because usually someone's only missing if there's some sort of event going on, right? Yeah, or they're dead. I doubt she'd be in here, but those things still look so weird to me. What? These, like, bulbous things. They look <laughs> diseased or something. What? Are, what is that thing called? The thing you, uh... That's in attics and stuff. In that, uh... That, what do they do? They're, like, I have no clue what you're talking about. <laughs> like, I don't are you either. talking about for insulating or something? Yeah, yeah, insulation. I don't, I don't know what they're ta uh, they're called, but they're usually not bumpy. I don't think. <laughs> like, I don't know. Maybe they are. Mostly, they're just like cylindrical foam. Ibuki, where are you? This episode will just be the search for Ibuki. <laughs> <laughs> the disappearance of Miyoda Ibuki. <laughs> <laughs> nah, maybe we should check out the diner. Maybe she'll be there again. So go back to yeah. Well, that wait, maybe that would explain why we can't get to her then. Mm. Maybe like we can't go to anyone who's usually at the uh, second island. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, because he doesn't think she don't want too far. All right, then I guess we'll. Chiaki's about, I think they said. Chiaki's uh, no. Oh yeah, okay, so what's Chiaki's top ones? Chiaki top ones are... Tips and Tricks 2nd Edition, Power Gauntlet, Nature Racer, and Sentry Poopery. Uh, let's see if we have any of those. Uh, Viva Eyes. Sunflower seeds and hope speak ring are also good. Ah, uh, uh, oh no, we don't. <laughs> Kiss note. Kiss note.
So this would I be? Okay? Uh, I'm surprised they don't appear as gifts for her. Weird. Mm-hmm. Uh... Oh, eh, we don't have that either. Hmm. Nah, it doesn't look like we have anything for her. Crow. Uh, what? Wait a second, what? What? A knife with Hope's Peak Academy crest on it. Tissue. Was this one of the things you mentioned? Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's Ryan. <laughs> it's me! You wanna give away Ryan? <laughs> no! How dare! That's our Ryan. <laughs> Man's nuts. <laughs> Just one. <laughs> uh, no. a, a book documenting a certain sword technique named after Sayaka M. The beautiful movements of this technique look like you're cutting through. This is weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> we can uh -huh. Oops, sorry. Let's, let's give her those. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what are the uh, like second tier ones for her? Uh, Viva Ice Century Pop. No, Viva Ice Sunflower Seeds and the Hope Speak Ring. Oh. I think we might have sunflower seeds. I think I saw something about sunflowers up here. Yeah, I saw I saw the I saw go. the icon, but I didn't know. Oh yeah, we have some. Okay, okay. so those are still good. All right, she's in her room playing video games, probably. Oh god, that looks kind of... <laughs> that one's... <laughs> Who are? Who is it? Oh wow. How'd you get all this shit in here? I wish I knew. I don't want to spend that much energy today, I think. I'd rather just sit still and read a book or something. With all those games around you? It's yucky. <laughs> you wanna read too? Let's go to the library together. Watch her pull out like manga from the shelf. <laughs> I spent time today reading with Chiaki. Look like Jack can I go a little closer? The seeds of that particular flower that loves facing the sun. They have a flavor somewhat similar to peanuts. The flower itself represents the sun's watchful eyes. I don't think it really tastes like peanuts, but okay. <laughs> You're giving this to me? <laughs> Thanks, I'll take good care of it and use it. She's staring off into space again, as usual. Uh, 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 sorry, I was getting a little sleep. Power nap. While you were standing? Impressive. Have you not been sleeping well? Gaming, I tend to forget about sleeping. Mood. Sometimes I even forget to breathe. Not big mood. <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. Plus, I keep having nightmares. I had a bad dream the other day, so I've been a little scared. Can I ask what kind of dream you had? Well, it was a dream about Trio the Punch. Huh? 
The statue at Jabberwock Island changed into a bald old man with a thin mustache. It's probably because that game also takes place on a tropical island. The more I think about it, the more the situation feels like that bizarre action game. We might eventually end up turning into sheep. What is this, Catherine? <laughs> <laughs> Who have you Trio been keying on, Chiaki? <gasps> Trio the Punch is... a game, right? What kind of game is it? More importantly, you must really enjoy games, huh, Chiaki? should I put it? I like it, but gaming is my life. Or maybe life is just a game? Deep. <laughs> Either way, that's all the more reason why killings shouldn't be allowed. It's not a game if you're not having fun. It doesn't mean anything if you just focus on winning or losing. Yes. You're right. It doesn't mean games always have to have happy endings, but you should get something out of beating them. There might be weird games here and there, but there are always ways of enjoying those too. Like how we somehow do with Danganronpa. <laughs> somehow. <laughs> and that's why bizarre games are fun. You can beat them as long as you do your very best. As expected of the ultimate gamer, I would probably just give up on a game like that. But to tell you the truth, there is one type of game that I'm not really good at. I see. What is it? Mm. I won't tell you. Uh, I see. Does she have a reason for not telling me? Well, just by talking to Chiaki, I feel like I was able to understand her a little better. So I guess that's good enough for now. I parted ways with Chiaki and went back to my room. Looks like it's almost time to meet up with Kazuichi. He told me to come to a supermarket. What's he, th what's he thinking all of a sudden? And keeping it a secret from the others. I don't want to think about it, but if he's plotting to... No, there's no way someone as carefree as him would like that. Hola. Huh? It's well past your ranch time, and there's no sign of Kasuichi. All of a sudden, the anxiety I had been keeping inside me began to swell like a ball to. Ah! Oh, what the heck? Don't get all pissed off just because I was a little late. The late? Oh, I get it. I totally forgot he's that kind of guy. A guy who doesn't mention me up late, even though he's the one who asked me to come. That kind of guy. Well, it sort of makes sense. So what do you want? Why do you call me out here like this? Well, you know. Can you do me a little favor? A little favor? Uh... I used to hear something. Apparently it's my sonest idea. For a change of pace. It looks like the girls are secretly planning to go splash around at the beach. 
It doesn't seem so secret now. Wait, don't tell me you. Better off me, Sonia. Splashing around in the sea is a nice idea. I admire her so much, it's shocking! My heart trembles around her so much, it's about to burn out. <laughs> so, let's crash it together. No, why me? Oi, oi. Well, it's worth to fake a coincidence all by yourself, isn't it? So how about a scenario where you and I go to the beach, and then we run into the girls by coincidence? Huh? Hey, you better not say no. I can't ask any of the other guys to help me with this. Ah. Nekomaru can't, he can't keep his mouth shut to save his life. And Gundam is... well, Gundam. You have one other option. Where is he gonna get her out of the question? <laughs> I understand where you're coming from, but... I don't feel like going to the beach. Hey, I took the time to prepare your swimsuit, you know? Uh, and then you're, you're just gonna walk all over my canned act? You're snapping at me? If you say no, I'm gonna bug you about it until you die. There's no way he's joking about that. This is Kasuichi, after all. If I have no choice, then fine. Sure? Yeah, Ooh, that's my Hajime. That's how Soul Brother should act. So, what do I have to do? Yeah. Well, based on what I overheard, it looks like they're going to Chandler Beach on the second island. That's how we gotta head over to that diner first. Our plan is to be at the beach before they get there. And we're gonna act like it's just a coincidence. Got it. So I need to go to the diner. Whoa, I'm getting all excited now. Well, that makes one of us, I suppose. Looks like he can't take a hint. It looks like they're going to Chandler Beach on the second island. That's why we got blah blah blah. blah. Yeah. Forgot what all was here. <laughs> Would you like to purchase something for the vending machine? Yeah, okay. see, this is how I got all the gifts. Yeah, you just buy them here. I was like, fuck, I'm not gonna do the one on one <laughs> machine. Lies, you didn't even know it existed. <laughs> <laughs> you right. <laughs> is that the gold sword from the first game? What? <laughs> oh. Maybe. Would be. Okay. And and and. I should probably get going.
<laughs> All right, we're here. Now we just have to stick out a spot and wait until the ladies arrive. Is he sure about this plan? I mean, isn't this a little too stalkerish? And where are they gonna come? Did you happen to overhear that with your sensitive ears too? Hmm. They mentioned something about coming a little after the sun starts to tilt. So maybe around 4 p.m.? I've never heard that phrase before. It's 3 p.m. right now, so... We still have to wait one more hour? <laughs> Always make your move early. That's just the basics, you know? Hey, I don't know if you should be talking like an expert right now. It's fine, it's fine. Just make sure you keep watch by the window. It'd be bad if you didn't catch Miss Sonia her, on her way to the beach, you know? It's your job to keep that from happening. To get to the beach, they gotta pass in front of the diner. You better keep your eyes peeled. This isn't a game. If this isn't a game, then what is it? I really should have just said no. Sitting, sitting at a table by the window, I rested my chin in my hands and absentmindedly stared out the window. They could have just had something to eat. Mm -hmm. I know, right? <laughs> Are they coming? Did they arrive? It hasn't even been 10 minutes yet. Twenty minutes passed, and then thirty minutes. As time passed by, the only things that grew were the volume of my sight and the weight of my regret. Say, what kind of seams do you think Miss Sonia will wear? Since she's a foreigner, how about a bikini? I can't. I can't come to terms with that face. <laughs> it's cute. It's cute, but it's so unfitting for someone <laughs> doing this. <laughs> I know, right? Don't you feel like there's a pure, innocent, mythical fantasy hiding between the top and bottom of a bikini? <laughs> Even if I wanted to agree with you, I don't know how to answer that. Wait, huh? And that's when it happened. In the corner of my eye, a certain someone walked by the front of the diner. What? Huh? Isn't that... I wonder what happened. I guess I should head over. We left the diner in a hurry and ran to where that person was standing. I knew it was you, Fuyuhiko. What are you doing here? Th that's my line! Oh, yeah. What the heck? You're awfully tense. Actually, why do you seem so flustered? Uh, who are you calling flustered? Don't go making false ac accusations, you bastard! Don't tell me. Oh my, is that it? You overheard my plan, didn't you? Huh? P plan? Huh? It's no use playing dumb. You overheard my plan, and follow us all the way here, right? Hey! What are you doing at this place? Ah, uh, that's a strange combo. Uh, hello. Um, today is another wonderful day. 
Well... You're not gonna get away now that I've caught you! Oh, I got so nervous I ended up blurting out something weird! What works with that voice change? Please don't hate me! I'll take the punishment as much as you like! She can capture me. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, you too. This is such a coincidence. Smooth. Um, <laughs> I never expected to coincidentally run into you guys here. If you're really just stuck at this. Yeah. Man, actually, Hajim and I were about to head to the beach together. Arama. Huh? Could that be what you ladies are here for? That's such a coincidence! It even seems like destiny. Something's obviously suspicious. Your eyes are moving around like salmon before they lay eggs! No, no way. I'm always like this. Uh, how should I put it? I always pay attention to my surroundings. Uh, I can't keep watching this. <laughs> As I sigh and look away from that embarrassing sight, I realized that he had disappeared. Huh? Where did where did Fuyuhiko go? Well, regardless, you two have arrived pretty early. It's early 3.30 p.m. You still have about 30 minutes until you meet the others. Smooth. Sudden. Um, why do you know we're going to meet with the others? And you even know our damn meeting time! Well, you see... Anyway, let's share the coincidence that brought us together. So is it okay if we, we join in too? Wow, he got forceful all of a sudden. So that's your ulterior motive. You're probably here for Sonya, aren't you? I really have no desire to do something so rude, like to climb the offer at all. But Sonia was the one who planned to go to the beach, so we need to ask her. Then it's all good. It's too drastic to think Miss Sonia will decline, so I just won't think it. Is he being an optimist or a pessimist? I don't really get it. Nah, nah. Hey, hey, is it alright if we go inside now? The Ibuki was gonna eat a good meal first, that's why I came early. <laughs> sure thing, let's wait inside. I can't take my mind off Fuyuhiko. Oh well, I've come this far. I can't turn back now. And with that, we will end things right here. Thank you guys for joining us, and see you next time. Bye bye! Bye! bye. How does. I never think about it. How does Rebecca know Icarus? <laughs> or vice versa? Where is it? Ugh. And what did that for me?
How do I get there anyway? I hear it. Yeah, it's early. 